Tomorrow marks 25 days till we get to open our prezzies from Santa. But a teenager hasn't had to wait that long. His dream has already become a reality and Michael Holland was at Tauranga Airport to see it all unfold. So Top Gun, this is it? Yes, it is. <laughs> super excited, super pumped, nervous. All of that and yep. more. And more. Are you going in the dull grey one or the stroppy blue one? The stroppy blue one. Of course. Of course. What, what kind of question is that? <laughs> Clearly the adrenaline's already starting to flow on a day when only one thing matters. Being in the moment. Have you told him you're having second thoughts, Jacob? Oh, nah, mate. <laughs> nah, mate. <laughs> it's, it's going to be one of the best experiences. Thundering low level over the Bay of Plenty, 17-year-old Jacob strapped into the back of one former military jet fighter. As much as I'd love to be in the driver's seat. His dad, his wingman, in the other. Today is a big tick day. It is. It is very much a big tick day. Off the bucket list. This is just priceless. He was 12 when he got diagnosed with synovial sar sarcoma, abdominal cancer and he had eight rounds of chemotherapy and 25 days of radiation and a huge surgery to remove the tumour. I went cancer free for about two years and on Christmas of all things I got re-diagnosed and that's when I became terminal the doctor said there's not much we can do for you. Is he thinking about any of that today? Not at all. The only thing is on his mind is getting in that plane. That's all he wants to do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That must make Mum's heart leap with joy. It does. You know, seeing him happy is the, the is all we want. I think his positivity has a huge part to play in how he copes with everything. Being this close to it's kind of scary, but so exhilarating. <laughs> a masterpiece of a machine. They think you're the pilot. Yeah, mate. <laughs> I am the pilot. What are you talking about? If he can have an awesome experience, yeah. I think that, um, yeah, I feel pretty damn good about that. Jacob's Rapid Joyride, organised by the social enterprise Uplift and Kind, which matches those doing it tough with aviation companies willing to give back. Spare seats in their helicopters, aeroplanes, skydives. Our catchphrase is making memories and cheeky smiles, and that's exactly what we're doing. This adventure also attracting donations from dozens of well-wishers on Give A Little. Everyone pitched in a little bit, and I'm so grateful, and I just can't thank people enough. People care, Jake. I know. It means the world. You've made these dreams come true for Jacob, and um, we wouldn't have been able to do it without you guys, so thank you. <laughs> that was amazing. Me and Dad could like see each other, and we we're just waving, <laughs> and just, oh, it was great. A bit of a sore ass. <laughs> How was it my ass is sore? <laughs> That's definitely something that would come out of his mouth. <laughs> You seen a cheeky smile today? Oh, I've seen a very cheeky, wide smile today. <laughs> I think you're smiling too. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Yeah, isn't it cool? Couldn't be more happy.